guys and welcome back to another video so today's video is going to be my monthly budget for the month of march and this is going to be a zero base budget i did the numbers already and i filled in everything so this video won't be long so let's just get right into it so for work you already know it's gonna be 13 20 that's just how much i get paid a month my side hustle and i got it budgeting at 200 i'm hoping to make more but let's just see i'm speaking it out there uber eats hoping also to do a hundred dollars for the month i think i could do more but i always budget lower just in case um i might decide one week i might not want to do you know uber eats um because i don't know if some of you guys know but i do do it walking so and then the weather's cold. I don't feel like doing it. You know, so on and so forth. So the total for that is $1,620. And then we come down here to my expenses. My rent is $500. My cable, I'm budgeting for $143. My Sprint um, is $150. And Capital One is $117. Woohoo, look at my freedom. Freedom went down. Um, it was $80 a month. It went down to $64. So you already know I'm doing something good because that interest is going down. My monthly payments are going down. So that is a good thing. Apple Music, $14.99. Um, phone storage, $0.99. Cents. I really keep saying to myself, I'm going to call them. And I don't. Because I don't see it in my subscription. It's on my phone. So I don't know where the storage thing is coming out. And then my MTA is going to take out 44 to complete my 127 so I can buy my unlimited Metro card for the month of March. So my total expenses are $1,033.98. So that leaves me with $586.02, which that's great, right? Because I believe last month, um, it was way less than that because a lot of stuff was higher. Um, and plus, I got some things like Disney Plus. I removed that. I closed that subscription. So what I'm going to do for my cash envelopes for food, I'm going to budget 25 I might put more. It all depends how much. If I make more money in Uber Eats or my side hustle. Pet, I'm going to do 25 Household, $30 because I got to bring that more uh, bring that up more because to buy like toilet tissues and anything else I might make an envelope for um like personal because that would be for our personal stuff like pads and shampoo and conditioner and things like that I, or I might just leave it on the beauty and just you know bring up beauty a little bit more but let's just see and then miscellaneous is twenty dollars beauty's ten. I actually went into my eyebrows with my last um, $8 that I put in there. And then, so for cash envelopes is $110. So we're going to go down to the sinking funds. And the sinking funds is, for the emergency, is $50. My vet emergency, I'm going to put $20. Hopefully, let's see. Because, like I said, none of this is really set in stone until I actually start making the side hustle and the Uber Eats. Um, Christmas, I'm hoping to put $30. Um, birthday um, gifts, I'm putting 5 Because I don't have no one's birthday until April. So I'm good. Senior dudes, um, $20. Home and move, $20. Car, $20. Cottage fund, $20. So sinking funds total is $185. Then for the future, the savings is going to be 50 and then for extra, it's going to be for Capital One and Freedom. I'm hoping to put $100 extra each in both, um, in both credit cards. So that's a total of $200. So it leaves me with a cushion of $41. So my income is $16.20. Take away $10.33, right? It's $5.87. Then take away $110. And then take away $1. 85 take away 50 take away 200 leaves me with 42 dollars 
Okay, so there is a dollar somewhere missing. There's a dollar missing somewhere, guys. And then it could be 42. So let's just put 42 because I thought it was 41. And that leaves me with a zero base budget. So we're going to change this to 42. So the cushion is just basically if I need it to maybe fill one of these up or maybe, you know, you never know with Sprint. Sprint might charge something else or maybe cable cable might just go up thank goodness it's just been staying the same so i'm happy with that so that's what cushion is or if i need some personal items household items or anything like that i can use this cushion which i might take this out the bank and put it in the envelope and leave it in the envelope i might just do that but yeah guys so this completes my monthly budget for March. Um, I hope you enjoy the zero base budget. If you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below. But if you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to share and subscribe and I'll be seeing everyone in my next video.